Hi everyone, I am Francesco Lombardi, and I'm here to introduce you to our brand new model Ramp Mobility, which allows the computation of time series of electric vehicle consumption and charge strategies for all European countries. To give you just a little bit of context, Ramp is a bottom-up stochastic model that we developed back in 2018, initially for uh, demand profiles for isolated microgrids. But soon we realized that the approach was versatile enough to be applied to any kind of user-driven demand profile, and so we came out with cooking profiles or domestic hot water profiles even at the country scale. And finally, this year we realized it was time for a RAM mobility application. RAM mobility is composed of two main modules. The first module is devoted to the computation of so-called mobility profiles, which means the driving pattern of each vehicle within a given population with its associated battery consumption. This kind of output has been validated against data, real data provided by ELED for the Netherlands, showing a good accuracy. Also, interestingly, the model shows being able to capture the diversity uh, in mobility profiles across different European countries. For instance, in this example, we can see that Poland has higher peaks compared to Spain due to having a composition of the population with a higher share of user types such as workers and students which concentrate their driving patterns in specific time frames. The second module of RAM mobility allows us to simulate the charging profile for each vehicle to respect the mobility profile that we have just computed. We allow up to four possible charging strategies. The first one is called uncontrolled, which means that each user charges the car as soon as possible and as much as possible. The second option is called perfect foresight and tries to approximate the kind of behavior that the grid operator might want to see in order to take advantage of vehicle-to-grid interaction. Finally, we have another two options. The first one is called night charge, in which everyone basically just charges the car during the night, if possible. And another one is called rest integration, in which everyone charges the car when there is an excess of renewable generation in the given area. Of course, these latter two options are a bit unrealistic, are a bit extreme, but still we provide all of them for each user of RAM mobility to make its own mix of strategies according to what they think is most realistic. All of this is available on GitHub as an open source uh, repository. And we're also working to provide just pre-run results for those who don't want to run the actual model uh, for many weather years on the Open Power System data platform. So thank you for your attention. And if you have any questions, just write an email or join our GitHub chat. Enjoy the MP. Bye bye.